This is an audiovisual representation of a study published in the Journal of Bone and Joint Surgery in 2020. Out of various protocols used to administer anesthesia, spinal anesthesia is one of the most commonly used. It provides various benefits to patients undergoing orthopedic surgeries like total knee arthroplasty, or TKA, and total hip arthroplasty, or THA. However, it comes at the cost of slow and unpredictable return of lower extremity motor function related to the use of long-acting local anesthetics. What, then, is the way out? A group of physicians undertook a prospective, double-blind, randomized clinical trial to determine if an alternative local anesthetic, mepivacaine, would allow better, more predictable return of motor function compared with the more commonly used low-dose bupivacaine for spinal anesthesia during primary THA and TKA. The study participants were divided into two groups, each receiving either mepivacaine or bupivacaine. Following the surgery, motor function was checked every 15 minutes till the participant gained full motor function, indicated by a score of zero on the Bromage scale. The researchers found that the return of lower extremity motor function was more predictable in patients who received mepivacaine than in those who received low-dose bupivacaine. Among patients who received mepivacaine, 1% achieved motor function return beyond 5 hours compared with 11% of patients who received bupivacaine. Patients who received mepivacaine regained their motor function about 26 minutes quicker than patients who received bupivacaine. These findings indicate that in cases that require spinal anesthesia, Physicians may benefit from using anesthetics like mepivacaine, which allow a quicker and more predictable return of motor function.